Hi everyone, today I'll be talking about how to export files from Flash into Composer. For those of you who are familiar with Flash, you will know that it's an animation tool that allows you to create smooth animations with bitmap or vector graphics. This character I have here is created from vector graphics that I made in Illustrator and imported into Flash. Um, and I used a series of very powerful tweening uh, tools in order to create this simple wave animation. And so let's take a deeper look into how I created this. Um, if you know, if you're familiar with Flash and you know that um, it uses symbols as its main building block. So this girl is a symbol and she is going to continue to do this animation um, no matter if you size her up, rotate her, or whatever you choose to do. So within this symbol, we'll zoom in, and we'll see that there are six separate individual pieces of her body, um, and they're all saved as symbols as well. So this arm right here is saved as a graphic symbol. You can also save it as a movie clip or a button, but for our purposes, graphic symbols work best for exporting out from Flash into Composer. So in order to export, you go File, Export, and export movie and then you can select the folder that you want it to go to let's say flash files folder I created and we'll call it girl.png and then save it and then the export PNG box will appear and it again shows you sort of the dimensions of your uh, stage right here and so right now it's doing 50% uh, cut down. So let's go ahead and make it the 200 by 290. And as you can see, it uh, creates the same aspect ratio. So you only have to change one, um, one number. So we'll go ahead and export that and go into our desktop afterwards and find that folder. And as you can see, there are all of my files, um, a series of a total of 30, and they're all the correct size. So we're going to want to um, zip these up into a zip file. So we'll select the first one, scroll down to the bottom, shift click, and then right mouse click, compress the 30 items and it'll create an archive.zip which you're going to have to probably rename let's call this girl.zip and then you just drop this zip file into your Demi Books Composer Books file on either your iTunes or Dropbox account and open it up in Composer and it's really easy it drops them in in the correct order and you can change the frame rate um, for this I just use 24 frames per second because that's pretty standard um, but yeah, it makes it very easy to export a whole bunch of um, frames in a very simple and easy to manage way. So I definitely recommend it. 